so the application to this school uh i've started uh today 4th of july and this is why i bring you this video right now because uh there are some things that might not be clear to you and you might end up not be able to apply to this school which is why i bring you the information right now okay so on this page where it says program open for application if you scroll down you are going to see that there is no list of any program that is available for you to apply to not because uh there's no program that is available right now okay there are more than 180 programs that are available at this school so i want to guide you through how you can apply to this uh new brunswick college right now and this uh college is one of the college that is open with the very lowest tuition right now okay so what you want to do first is i've already started the application for someone already what you want to do is to go back to this page how to apply on this how to apply page you are going to see how to apply okay no not this one uh let's start from the beginning uh let me see how to apply okay yes on this particular page on this app how to apply page it says uh the application started today which is 4th of july okay which is a tuesday right okay so you want to scroll down to this session where you have international applicants and you have to click on how to apply when you click on this how to apply it will bring you to that page that was the page i opened uh previously and if you scroll down you are going to see that there are number of steps that you need to follow to be able to submit a successful application okay so first thing here is that i want you to pay attention because it's not just about applying but for you to know what you need to submit for you to be able to get admitted into this school I've already started this application for someone uh, today already and I've seen uh, what uh, I've been feeling for the person and actually uh, that's one of the reasons I have to bring you this okay so here you have to pick your program then you have to check if the seat is still available for the program that you want to apply to then you have to check the program requirements okay so i made a video yesterday that you should get yourself prepared okay most time people don't know what uh, all these short videos are doing okay so if you've watched that yesterday video and you've come to the website to come and do justice to this website and then by now you should skip uh step three okay after that you should know that this school is not tuition free but is the cheapest in canada right now and with this school you can get your permanent residence in one year after your program so if you've not seen that uh video i dropped yesterday make sure you do where to watch that video because i give more information okay so and this school is not tuition free you have to pay tuition and there are also some other fees that you also need to pay as well okay so after passing through steps four then what information should i have readily available uh required documents and how to submit them submit your application uh, review admission process okay so uh the application i started on this first page uh it has time out you can see here that it says time out right now and uh the one i'm doing on the incognito page you might not be able to see it because it incognito does not share screen with you okay i'm i'm at the stage of uh filling in the person high school information right now okay i'm in 75 percent away uh from this application right now here it says add high school and all of this so i'm going to be sharing with you on this other page so that we look at it so after following all these nice steps where's the steps uh i think it's and i think it's this okay how to apply okay after uh following every steps then uh you need to make sure that you have all the requirements and on this page you are going to see that there's nowhere for you to click the apply button okay so what you want to do is to scroll up come back here and come to this step seven click on this plus icon on this step seven and you are going to see 
this apply online now okay so if you go to that previous page you are going to see that there's no list of programs that are available so before you even start to click on this apply button make sure you follow the instruction i gave in yesterday video click on this uh programs and courses when you click on that program and courses it will bring you to this page where you have the li this list of program and courses right now okay so uh i'm looking at applying for <coughs> for this particular program uh electrica okay so i will click on this i will open it in a new tab if i click on that then it's bring me to this page is that the page no not this page i'm using a more smaller phone today so program details okay so this is the page okay so once you come to this page you are going to see apply now tuition and fee visitors ask question so uh, if you want to read more information just do that but if you don't want to now here you can click on tuition and fee to go and check the tuition fee uh the tuition fee is around 9500 for most of the uh one year courses and after this one year you are getting your permanent residence right so if you click on this apply now then it will bring you to this page again okay so you have to be very careful that you are doing the right thing if it brings you to this page make sure you click on this how to apply international applicant again once you click on that then it will bring you back to this page where we started earlier then you now go to step seven okay so i'm just showing you what you need to do right now okay then you click on apply online when you click on apply online okay so you can see now that he's already asking me to sign in because i've already started someone application right okay so i don't want to use this uh information i want to use another uh I want to use i want to start a fresh application oh so what do i do now uh this is actually not my device okay so you might need to ap apply let me see oh uh, i will have start the recording before i start the application okay so um let me see oh. Oh, oh, oh let me go back uh where are those steps we are going to this step seven open a new tab uh that should be the last page now still bringing me back to that page okay so what is basically uh if it's my device i can know how to navigate the, but right now i'm not used to this device because my device uh i took my device for repair so uh most of you guys if you can't find me right now uh i took my device for uh repair and if you notice i'm using another device right now and this is even a more smaller device right just to keep you guys updated right okay so i'm going to be giving you uh, the information behind this okay so when i click on apply online now it's bring another page again that says apply as international applicant or apply as uh i think domestic uh applicant that's someone who is currently in canada so you are going to be clicking on as an international applicant then when you click on that it was it asks me for the first name uh the family name that's the surname the middle name the date of birth then uh it asks me to create a password a password and also to confirm the password then after that it asks me for three security question so it asks me to set three security question when i set that security question then i click on apply i mean I, I click on register so after that then i was able to to sign in into the system okay 
so let me see if i can log in right now <coughs> okay so uh, this is what i used just now user id let me user id let me see if i can i think okay i can always do a password reset so i'm going to use i'm going to use another the second person login credential though i'm far gone into the application but i'm going to see if i can log in i started this application start right now and i wanted to screen grab uh this information or oh, i totally forgot so uh ah uh, why is it not logging in okay so i think uh, we have to this information is correct because i just created it okay i'm going i'm going to i'm going to try this again uh, this is why i always like keeping information safe this device i'm not used to this device so uh it's actually giving me a dick select your language i selected english so oracle people soft I don't know why this is coming up right now so maybe i need to go back to that page how to apply step seven okay i don't know why this is not coming up it's still the same page the information is correct so the information is correct I log in with the correct information. Uh, okay, I want to put it again. Mm. Okay, so uh, I will just give you an overview of what you are going to be seeing. Uh, I just wish I can uh, log in right now to show you. Okay. Ah, oh, this information is correct. Okay, fine. So once you just uh, create your account, make sure that you uh, you log in with uh, you provide the login information you can remember. That information is correct. I would have loved to uh, use my laptop to log in, but I can't have access to that right now. Okay, so uh actually it was i was at the steps of putting the home address putting the uh the contact information phone number i was selecting the phone number putting the country code asking for postal code then after that i was asked to provide uh high school information and also uh post secondary school information if applicable so if you are going for a one-year program you want to make sure that you are not using post-secondary school because uh when you are applying for a program a program you are applying to supposed to be an upgrade of whatever you are applying to okay so if you are applying for a certificate program make sure you use only your high school and uh make sure you provide every information correctly so that uh it will help you uh, have the high chance okay so and also do where to uh, check every other information here i just switch i can log in right now to show you let me try again let me try again okay so i just wish i could log in right now to 
to show you what uh, the inside look like and it's not taking me to a fresh application page okay so i'm going to catch up with you in another one okay thank you